YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, crew? Haven't done one of these in a good little minute. Today is a workout video. I will be doing, um, I'm gonna do some chest, I'm gonna do some biceps. Uh, I'm also gonna do a forearm. I am gonna do a little bit of back. I'm gonna do my triceps for sure. I'm gonna do a little bit of back uh, and I'm gonna do a little bit of deltoids. It's gonna be a little overall to everything, guys. Oh, sorry about that. Sorry about the view. Excuse the hair, the news, you know, tomorrow's haircut day. So, definitely can't wait. Love haircut day. Y'all probably get a video of that. Uh, me and, me and Zion in the barbershop, he can his haircut tomorrow as well. But yeah, y'all, y'all stay tuned. Again, anybody out there who wants to lose some weight, <laughs> I'll let you boy. Uh, I can help you lose weight. Uh, I can help you gain weight. Uh, with the gaining part, depending on your job, it's a little difficult especially for myself, trying to gain that weight back. But you know, the steady constant movement pace is hard too, but I have been gaining my weight back, which is really, really, really good. I started using this protein shake and it's been helping me gain my weight back as, as far as that, that. Also as well, getting me some more definition in my arms and what I'm trying to grow. Uh, but yeah, y'all stay tuned, check me out. Again, anybody who wants to get workout or anybody who wants um, some input on what to do or how to do it, man, holler at me y'all. Excuse the lines, you took my do-rag off. But yeah, check it out. Bye bang. Aww. Here we go, crew. So again, guys, when you're doing these, these workouts, you want to make sure that you have the good technique and great posture to make sure that you're getting the best gains possibly that you can gain at that time. So again, look at me right here. My feet are uh, within my shoulder length. Uh, I got a good little posture, nice little slightly bend in there. You don't have to bend if you don't want to, but I like to bend just a little bit. And you usually want to rep real nice and slow, get your nice little pause. There you go. Pull up, pause. One, two. One, two. Just like that, guys. So you, everything that you do, that slow rep, you'll get more gains, I promise you. All that fast rep and stuff, it just looks good for the ladies. Or if you're a girl, it looks good for the guys. Because it's, it's like, oh, man, they pushing out that, they pumping out that, that stamina. I mean, they, they pumping out that power. Ooh, no, nah. but you're not really gaining much when you, when you rep pretty fast. You gain more when you repping uh, as a slower pace. So I got my first set out the way. I added another 10 pounds. So here I go, I got a little bit more bend just because it's a little more heavier. And guys, you don't wanna sway. Oh yeah, here we go. I started getting a little cramped. But you don't wanna sway neither when you're um, when you're doing workouts. So yeah, I've been holding a little bit. The reason I'm holding that weight at the bottom because it's making my muscles contrast more. When it contrasts more, it means it's squeezing. When you're squeezing, you're gaining. You're gaining, you're getting, you're winning. That's exactly what you want to do when you're working out. You want to gain. Or if you're working out to lose weight, you can lose weight, you know. Uh, you can also squeeze and lose weight. Hey, you can do both. But check it out. You can see me, I'm doing a little, little sway. I shouldn't be swaying that much. If you're swaying, you want to loosen up some of that weight. Loosen up some of that weight, and I got hot. Turn on fans on, turn on fans on. But yeah, if you're swaying, guys, that means it's it's too heavy, okay? When it's too heavy, you need to lose some, um, take some weight off. Take some weight off. And it's just, it's just working on your, worry about your technique and just worry about, you know, doing the right thing, the right posture. That way you won't hurt yourself and you're getting gains. But here we go, I'm about to get my other set in. <clears throat> Got that cramp right in the bicep. Oh yeah, you feel it. Yeah, we see you, big boy. Yeah, we see ya. <laughs> yeah, baby. Ooh, baby. Yeah, work it out. Ooh. What you doing there, Ryan, boy? You got a crib? Jackhammer. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's get back to work, baby. Ooh, yeah. Get the gains. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, yeah. I said Peter Piper. All right, so. Here we go. Get that gains in. And cramping a little bit, but I'm trying not to let it bother me too much. Ramp it up a little bit more. I feel like I was leaning more on my on my right arm than my left arm, so I'm trying to sit here and get more gains in my left arm as well. So again, you want to get up there, you want to squeeze. And once, once you pull up, squeeze. And once you're down there, also squeeze. So you can squeeze right here, squeeze it, let it down slowly, and you can squeeze right here and hold it. I mean, look at the muscles itself. You guys, you can see that I'm gaining the muscles. I'm gaining, gaining the gains because I'm squeezing the, on the top point and at the lowest point. And that's exactly what you want to do. Squeeze at the top. 
slow down and squeeze at the bottom. So again, when I'm going down to the bottom, I'm not setting the weight down on the other weights that's not getting lifted. I'm just setting it very close and I'm holding that weight so it can trash, okay? So I believe I got one more set. Yeah, flex on them, man. You earned it. You earned it. Flex on them. Yeah, so here we go. I got my, my curls at the waist and now I'm about to hit this chest up. Here we go, push it out. One, two. One, two. So if you look at the weight right there, right behind my, my gluteus, maximus minimus, <laughs> but if you look at the weight back there, you can see I'm not fully setting it down. I'm barely tapping it or I'm setting it right above, or I'm holding it right above it. Again, that's where I can get that most, that most gain out there. So when you're pushing it out, you want to squeeze. Squeeze. I try to squeeze that. I try to find more than one point of squeeze. A lot of people say squeeze when you're pushing out, but I try to squeeze whether I'm pushing out or I'm holding the weight. That way you get the gains at the, at the toppest point and at the lowest point. So I just add another more 10 pounds. Every rep that I do, no matter what it is, I always try to add 10 pounds. I try to add 10 pounds. Because you don't want to sit here and do the same repetition of the same weight because you're not really gaining nothing at that point. You want to challenge yourself mentally and physically. So here we go. Got another set going on. Pushing on out. Got your breathing technique, guys. Make sure you do breathe. That also helps you gain. And it helps you from not passing out. Especially when you're working out by yourself. You pass out, hey, who's gonna be there, you know, to check on you or whatever, but just like that. So it's getting a little tougher around the five, five repetition marker. Keep pushing out, try to fight it through, try to hold it. Tell yourself, I got one more. Push it out. Tell yourself, I got one more. Bang it out. There you go. There we go. So I got my second set out the way. Here's my third set. I did add another 10 pounds. Stupid heavy. I shouldn't be lifting heavy, but hey guys, I can't help it. I want to lift heavy. So that's what I'm going to do. Even though I live heavy, stuff, I work all day, but hey, it is what it is. But yeah, get it out, my man. Push. I know it's tough. Guys, try to challenge yourself. Every time you try to challenge yourself, it get difficult, but it makes you strong. Yeah. I know, I know, finish it out. So I'm, I'm burnt out this time, I'm feeling it. My freaking chest is burning, 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 burning. But I gotta finish the rep, I got to miss my ear. I'm motivated to finish it out, I can't be a quitter. I gotta finish it out, not for myself, but show you guys that if I can do it, you guys can do it too. So we're pushing, we're pushing it out, my man, there you go. Put a little back into it, just a little bit. So I got all my, uh, my chest out the way, so now I'm doing triceps. Again, guys, like I told you, triceps. When you're doing your triceps, you want to make sure you keep them close to your body as possible, squeeze it in. And as you see, I'm holding that weight. Holding that weight. But technique is also, it's, it's the key factor of getting gains. One of the key factors of getting gains is technique. So again, keep them elbows tucked in. Try to push, uh, put your elbows in the back of your back. Just try it. And that's how you, uh, you keep your elbows uh, pushed in. But here's my second set. Pushing in, I'm already burnt out. I just did two arms, three arms in a row. So I'm already burnt up, but I gotta push it through if I wanna grow, you know? But this is the triceps. The triceps, again, guys, for those of you who don't know, it's on the back of your arm. So when the guys or a girl hit the flick of the wrist, look what time it is, you can see the back of their arm flex out. This is that muscle back there, okay? So got my second set. Hold and shake it out, my man. Yeah, yeah, I feel you. Carter, Carter, guitar. No, you didn't. You guitar? I don't know. Smash the guitar? Boy, you disrespectful. How oh, disrespectful, man. Add another 10, get back on the thing. Let's get back to work. <laughs> oh, that boy running. Oh, oh, dip, dip. Uh, uh, swag, swag sauce. Get back on there, man. We got some work to do. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's get back here in our third set. So I'm really feeling it here. I added, right after that, I had 10 pounds, and I add another plate on there for so 15 pounds. Pushing it out, I'm feeling it. I'm burnt out, but I gotta finish it, guys. So remember, squeeze, squeeze. Make sure you squeeze. When you squeeze, that's when you gain. When you gain, you're doing the right thing. You feel me, man? Rhythm. 
Yeah. Yeah. Come on, finish it out. Here we go. They got here like, man, I don't want to do this. I hate lifting weights, but man, I gotta. I like looking the way I like looking. I want to gain. I want to grow some more. So I gotta finish it out. I think I have five more to go if I'm not mistaken. I try to keep count when I'm doing videos and stuff like that. But I finished my third set. Doing the butterflies now. Butterflies is one of the greatest, greatest, greatest ways of, of growing out that chest. The greatest way. And it helps you with your viper. For those of you who don't know what a viper is, it's right below your armpit. On your ribs. Right below, my, below your armpit. Behind your ribs, upper ribs. You got that cobra vein coming out. This will help you with your cobra as well. So I love the fly. I love the butterfly. It helps with the chest and it gets you all stretched out and it, it, it makes you more elastic. But I got my first set of the way. I'm doing my second set, more challenging way. So if you look at my chest, y'all, I'm squeezing. Squeeze. So when I put my hands together, I interlock them. It means I'm just trying to help myself make the pass touch. I'm trying to, that's my main goal is to make the pass touch and squeeze. I know. Man, I don't know why I listen to it. I ain't want to listen to it. So you know what? I'm going to turn this, man. I ain't feeling that. Up. Oh, what is this? Up. Oh, I ain't feeling this. These are, oh my God. Oh my God. I just want to work out. Some good music. Oh, I think this is a good, yeah, this is a good song. I'm going to work out to this right here. Work out to this right here. But yeah, yeah, here we go. I'm going to finish it out. Thug it out, thug it out. Got to finish it out. Trying to get the chest. Squeeze, squeeze, push, push. In a lock. Give me them pads. Give me them pads. If I don't get them pads together, then I'll try to at least get it close as possible. Squeeze it in. There we go. And you can see me go all the way out and it helps the outside of your chest. It helps push your chest out and also helps the upper part of your chest. So like I said, this 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 workout right here, man, this actual exercise, I love it because it hits, to me personally, it hits every part of my chest that I want to hit or every part of your chest, period. Yeah, you feeling it? Okay. 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 Go ahead and finish it up, big dog. Uh, there you go. Also, I think the lower you are, as far as gripping the uh, the butterfly bar, is the better you get. So again, you interlock like that, and you're helping myself trying to touch your pads. When you hold it like that, you squeeze that chest. Oh my God, I, it, it burns. When I say it burns, y'all, it burns. It burns. And when burn is, it's burning, when you're working out, of course. <laughs> Not no usher, let it burn. But when you're working out and it's burning and you can feel it, it means you're gaining. So I told you guys I'm gonna do a little back. I need to get back and doing backs. I, I don't do as much back as I should. But my back is it's, it's decent, but it could be better. But as you can see, right, be, right below my, my armpit there, you can see that muscle contrasting for the upper, upper part of the shoulders and back. And as you can see through my shirt, you can see the, the, the definition of my muscles. Uh, working out So when you working out guys, you got to make sure you work out everything You can't look deformed. You can't just have big arms and no chest. You can't have big chest. No arms You can't have a up, uh, big upper body and, and lower uh, small lower up uh, lower body You can't have big lower body. And you can't have small upper body. I'm gonna make sure you well proportioned So I do hit legs I've been doing a lot of legs, actually, uh, calf races and and squats. You know, at my home. All right, crew, this is going to end today's blog, my workout video. Hope y'all enjoy. Again, anybody got questions on regards of what to do if they want to work out with me, and just shoot me a text, shoot me a comment on here, and I got you. But then lay down. Oh, hold on, let me get that view for y'all so y'all can. But lay down and enjoy that beautiful, beautiful sunset right there that's one of my favorite part about the day i get to see the sunset i can see it right in front of me but yeah guys that's gonna be it for today see y'all next time let's take it y'all one more time let's see if i get it to y'all uh nope peace ah. <laughs>